Hi guys and welcome back to my channel obviously i did all that just to show my nails <laughs> anyways so this video is my march favorites everything that i've bought in march some of the things could also be from the end of february because i just wanted to include them in this video yeah like you can see they're still a bit visible but like it's much better than before so there are certain products that like especially in skincare that have been working out for me really well and I just want to share that. This here I present to you the March 2024 wow. favorites. So the first thing that I want to talk about is something that I use every day, day and night without a fail. This product did wonders for my texture. I, I keep my hand on my heart. I'm not going to lie about any products here because I've been lied to a lot by like a lot of influencers. Because you know, when you don't have an ideal perfect skin, like I don't, I have acne and everyone who like on internet like when you see tiktok or youtube or instagram and anyone is claiming like oh this product is gonna make your skin better or this product is gonna solve this issue for you and they're like saying it's with so much conviction and you know they don't really show you the result thing like even in some videos they do and it still doesn't work and i am and if you don't have like good skin you get what i mean like i'm sorry like my words are really clustered because there's a lot of emotions involved in this but like i keep watching that and as soon as I see someone like recommending a product like, oh, this is going to work for you. It gives me that hope, you know, that this is going to make my skin better. And who does social media and doesn't have perfect skin, I do get a lot of comments and a lot of like hate on my acne. Like a lot of people like giving me unsolicited dermatological advice all the time. You know, it's part of like putting yourself out there that people will have opinions and you have to take them. And I have, I have literally no problem with it, but it... It does somewhere like make me feel like, oh, I wish I had clear skin, you know? For some people, it's so natural and normal to have that. And I wish I, I did too. I wasted a lot of money on skincare products that made my skin either worse or didn't work at all. I promised you like I would never lie about a product if it doesn't work, whether it comes in PR or anything, if it doesn't work, I'd rather pay the company and tell them like take the money but I'll promote your product if it doesn't work for me. So the first product that really helped with my texture was this pads. Centella Relief Green 1 toner pads from this brand. Nimbusin is a very popular Korean brand and they make other things as well but I've only tried their toner pads uh, which I just bought from Coupon because like I just searched toner pads and they were like the number one there. And I just want to tell you, this thing really like calms the redness down for my acne. Like every time I wash my face, the first thing I do a lot of improvement in the texture of my face. And my face feels immediately super clean. And because when you have like active acne and you wash your face, sometimes, you know, the acne breaks and like it it helps like sort of like disinfect your face. Like you can see, I have almost finished it as well thing is like hyaluronic acid now I, I know there are like a lot of brands that have hyaluronic acid out there uh, I've tried the ordinary one and personally for me it I don't feel like a huge difference with it I have also tried the Toridin it's a very popular Korean brand again that has um, low molecular hyaluronic acid that one also I didn't really see a huge difference for myself and it's this one hyaluronic acid that I'm gonna about to show you that literally feels amazing on your face like this hyaluronic acid um, I already showed you so this is the Goku John lotion um, and this is like their hyaluronic acid lotion it's first of all for the price you get this huge bottle this is 500 ml and i use it every day and you can see like only this much has been used and i just like do this on my face and this hyaluronic acid hydrates your face but like it doesn't have any stickiness it's so thin it's like water okay but, like in terms of the texture it's like this do you see it's like water literally young you can find this in korean pharmacies acne one of the biggest things that makes ag acne so like such a bad experience to have is the acne scars you can take a most corner i got it from the korean pharmacy and every night after i wash my face i do my toner a hyaluronic acid i apply this on my like wherever almost like 
anywhere that I see any acne scars forming and the next day my face is clear of acne scars. Their products that work better than Noscarna, like Medacasil. The next thing I want to talk about is these pimple patches. So pimple patches are like, you know, everywhere, you know. But the thing is, not all pimple patches work for me. Like, because I've tried like almost every single brand of pimple patches because, you know, I have acne prone skin. Like, it's a fact now. I go get a pimple like right here or like right here. I, I don't know if you can still see, but like I used to have one like right here and I used this pimple patch for like two days and it's like, it's almost gone. Yeah, it's much more expensive than the other pimple patches that are available in the market, but like it also does the work a billion times better than those so will cure acropas so like you can see it has these like tiny micro needle kind of like thing in it yeah see micro needles yeah so you basically it comes with like two things so one thing is like a patch of tea tree oil it burns a bit if you put it on your acne but i swear to god it did i don't know what it does to it but like it fixes it for two days and i promise you that big huge fat pimple will be gone that i'm gonna talk about bro this was such a like it's like god sent this product to me I got this as my sephora birthday gift so i didn't like buy it like bundle of a brand called Careology 95 and i've never heard of it and honestly like i already have like uh i don't try like i'm not very keen on trying new skincare I don't have like a carnival of acne going on my face by trying new skincare but like they gave it to me and then you know in that bundle there was this product and it's like a night facial oil and i used it i used it like every day and every morning i woke up with my skin looking better than yesterday and like it just evenly looks like it just looks really good in the morning and it feels really good and i don't know what it does but overnight i feel like it does some kind of magic on my face d5 wee blue uh, night facial oil like it's helped with my acne it's helped with my texture it helps with pigmentation it like makes my face feel good like it's a toner which is like the Kerology 95 re blue boosting multi toner this toner is really great as well but i haven't used it like you can see i haven't used it enough to be like oh this is like one of my favorites this month it makes my skin feel good but you know because i'm using toner pads i don't want to like overdo products on my face like too much of anything is not like good so don't like put like 50 different products then you won't know which product is working and which product is not working um, refreshingly soft moisturizing cream in this like video where a girl ran a lab test okay so she basically ran this like lab test where she's like checked the um formulation of this cream uh with the formulation of the la mer cream and la mer and this one have to a huge extent the same formulation so that is like insane because you know how expensive la mer is these products in like a pr package but i still want to talk about them like yeah it's vegan it's not harming any animals and also like underneath makeup to get that you know like this glowy like smooth base um without like foundation or anything just like a skin tint and concealer this product underneath makeup like use it in my morning skincare routine because i feel like throughout the day it keeps my face hydrated and i'm also taking accutane uh and you know accutane has a purge period of and like your skin like gets super dry so this has really helped me to keep my skin hydrated while taking accutane the moisturizer that i have been using like almost every day is the mix on bean cream moisture to say that this moisturizer has a very thick consistency i want to show you the consistency for it and so it has a thick consistency but like you can say that as soon as like you spread it out it's a little sticky but it's like the kind of sticky like if you put it under makeup it will grip on your makeup sticky but like as soon as it'll dry like if you give it like 30 seconds sorry about that if you get it 30 seconds this is not gonna be sticky anymore and um, you can see it is very hydrating and moisturizing so i think the good thing about this brand is that they don't go overboard with the ingredients of this this is the universally best ranked sunscreen ever and i am all for it i totally agree with it it's the beauty of joseon sunscreen I have to 110% say that this is my favorite ever sunscreen. I've tried so many sunscreens and you know guys, I, I didn't wear sunscreen for the longest time because I just hated how it felt on my face. Like I, 
oh i was so irritated annoyed by the way sunscreen felt on my face that i would literally not wear sunscreen and go out and you know that's a skincare crime and this sunscreen changed it for me i cannot leave my house without sunscreen because of how good it feels on my face texture and like everything about this sunscreen is just amazing chef's kiss this sunscreen blend so like you do this and you can see it has no white cast and it like literally gives you like that glass skin like i already bought another one because of how good it is now let's move on to the combo that i found and i can't live without for the rest of my i love this 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 is it this is what i have been like missing out on my life all my life it's by the hair fix by the it also kind of works as a primer to like start your makeup so you spray this on your face it's like it literally mattifies your base it makes like a plain smooth canvas for you to do makeup on you will even if you do this it won't smudge like bro when i curl my hair with the dyson okay literally in an hour the curls open if i don't spray this so this product like literally will keep your hair in place and it's not like as harsh and like you know the other hairsprays they make your hair like a rock when you spray it on this does it but only for the first few seconds and then later on when you touch your hair it feels nice like smooth it's not like a rock i got this lip scrub from etsy the house and my lips have naturally gotten really pink i will remove my lip product and show you the thing uh, it's a bit harsh so use it lightly on your lips because one day I, my lips like started bleeding because of how but also i'm a dumbass and i was like scripts i don't really think it matters which brand you're using like you can even make one at home but if you're lazy this is a good option this vitamin c it's like a japanese brand really good like it's really good and i'm kind of like i want to go to japan and i want to get this you can get it here but like in japan it's obviously cheaper it is like i don't like the way it it smells very really strongly of oranges uh oily on my face but it does the work. Maybelline skin tint. It has vitamin C and SPF. Not a foundation. A skin tint. Good for your skin. Has good ingredients. What else do you need? And the prize. I must. Bro, I used to. I have tried such expensive skin tints that did nothing for my face. Didn't even hide my acne. And when you break out, oh my god, the amount of money I've spent on base products like makes me want to cry that I did. Why did I not? Because I used to be like, you Maybelline, like you like cheap products, so not good for your skin. Bro, bro, don't be like that. Don't, don't, don't look at this. This is so good. Concealer to first, like as the first step of your makeup after you do your base primer and the spray. Uh, use the NARS pot concealer to conceal the like red acne in your face, okay? You conceal them with like a brush, like you dip it and you conceal, conceal, conceal and then take a flat brush, a flat foundation like face brush and then put this in the back of your hand and make like very thin like sheer layers of it on it and blend and trust me, you don't need foundation. You will never use foundation after this product you will never use foundation after this like this thing that has literally changed the game of my nose contour also i got as a sephora birthday gift so i already had uh this is the fenty beauty co contour stick it's the contour stick right matte stick it's this is in the shade amber and this has literally changed my nose like my nose contour game it's like like very like you know cool tone brown sure so like when you do it on your nose like it looks like like mitty like you put mud on your face okay but like when you blend it does it like makes you look like you've had a nose job like i'm not kidding it does the nose contour in such a subtle natural way that i love um she glam it's shaped like a paw because it's like it's really cute glam it's like this paw shaped brush um it's very cheap but it is so gorgeous please don't go on the price it really works well and it's not made me break break out and i break out like literally the next day when i use a product that's not good for my skin but this has not made me break out so that means it's a good product it's like this color it's such a not like nice you know color and i'm gonna show you how it looks like when you blend it so you use this brush sorry like my hand is like in a weird position but like when you blend it this is how it ends up looking. It looks very natural, like just do this blush and that's it. That's it. That's the no makeup makeup look. This is the perfect blush for the no makeup makeup look. That I I can safely say 
is my favorite makeup find of this month like favorite this simple packaging but it's magic inside it's the hints glow radiance balm it's actually very popular in create you can see it's giving radiance because like i ain't lying bro this is amazing okay and this is the shade I have it in the shade Tender Room, but I want to get all the shades in this. So what this thing does is magic. Yeah. Um, okay, it looks like it has too much pigment, but it's really not. And what it does is like... Like you can see this glow on my face, right? That looks like I have glass skin from within. It's the magic of this thing. It is a glow balm and it is amazing bro so i got this one okay it's kind of like it has some blush on it but like i got this brush okay and it's the softest brush ever look at this it's so soft it's so good and it's so cheap the most convenient thing i've bought like this month in terms of makeup sorry it was gonna fall it's this it looks like a normal thing right this small it's like literally the size i can put it in my purse easily and go out anywhere a blush brush how cool is that you don't need to carry a huge ass full-size brush in your purse to like fix your makeup they like, fix your blush in it. when you're out you can just carry this which is so convenient and now it's time for the lip products and you can see I have a handful I the lip product and show you all these these are the chic that's how Koreans pronounce it because today I was uh, I was having dinner with my like Korean tutor and she literally I said like oh she's like oh which Korean makeup brand do you like and I was like the Seek she's like the Seek and I was like oh I'm definitely pronouncing it wrong the <laughs> Seek the color rose milk tea and in the color nudie fig product is how messy it gets do you see that that's the only problem I have with this so if you don't like packaging that gets messy then i don't recommend this but it's a let me show you what it does so the other shade nutty fig nutty fig is that what it is in a similar category i got the she glam uh, i got the she glam one as well it's it's the lip plump. It's a lip plumper. This is how the color looks like. It's one of their. The shade, it's so nude that you can barely tell that it's there. Okay, but it still makes your lips look bigger. So I find that interesting. This is the like tom for the. But it's just the packaging. I want to show you the packaging because the packaging is gorgeous. It's the Tom Ford bush. And this is how it looks like inside. It's really cool for this reason. That I'm just gonna show you. Just wait for a few seconds. Color in it. You just apply it and you'll watch slowly that it according to the I don't know pH or according to something in your lips like uh, it's literally gonna be different on everyone's lips so something in your lips it reacts with this and it produces the most naturally fitting lip color for your face really a unique lip color that you have I also got as a gift from Sephora it's like the fresh Shein like this one fresh and lovely applicator and i try this is like the one overpriced lip tint that i will keep going back to it is the benefit go go tint it's like this and can you spread it on my hand also when you spread it i love the color it gives when you spread it like it's we are done with this march favorite skincare makeup edition and i hope you like this i hope you enjoyed this video i have been really consistent with youtube in the month of march month of march has been special because i feel like i worked really like out of my comfort zone and i have been like consistent on this platform and it has paid off like i know none of my videos have like insanely gone viral but 
I know a lot of you, like a lot of new people have subscribed to this channel and as long as like analytics are going upwards, I, oh, it makes me hopeful, makes me want to create more content and makes me feel more like diligent towards my work and I am genuinely having fun doing this, like share more of my thoughts and like I know that I have a lot of meaningful thoughts in my mind that I want to give voice to and this platform is perfect for that. There are many things I want to talk about, many important pressing matters that are in my mind all day that I want to come up and talk about here. And I also want to create like create little bubbles of my memories and to forms of vlog and share anything that has helped me. I'm very grateful for everyone who's watching this video and thank you. I don't usually film any outros because like I'm honestly like I don't really know what to say but I am gonna start saying thank you in the end of every one of my videos because I am grateful for everyone who's watching because I like, it feels great that someone's actually sitting there and watching and hearing what you have to say yeah thank you so much for watching and i hope that you enjoyed this video and every month we're gonna do the month's favorites but these were my march favorites and i love these products and i hope they help you as much as they helped me and yeah that's it for this video